Several Columbia agencies are hoping for some new sidewalks along Business Loop 70. It could cost hundreds of thousands of dollars to do, but groups I spoke with hope it makes things safer and easier for people to get around the area. Sarah Huaco sees every day the need for a sidewalk on Business Loop 70 just outside her store's front window. People that are neighbors is around, they don't walk around because they don't have sidewalks. Huaco thinks filling in some sidewalk gaps on the Business Loop may make it an easier place to get around. Columbia's Bicycle and Pedestrian Commission wrote a letter to MoDOT asking it prioritize a sidewalk between Garth Avenue and Providence Road. The group says the area could see more foot and bike traffic when the food bank moves to the business loop in 2023. Um, not just gaps in sidewalks, but we have whole stretches without usable sidewalks. Carrie Gartner runs the Business Loop 70 Community Improvement District. The CID is working with the city and state to pay for sidewalks on several strips. One project from Providence to College Avenue could cost the CID about $700,000. Right now, people are kind of winding through parking lots and sometimes they're forced to go out in the street, which is never safe for particularly someone in a wheelchair um, or, or small kids. There's no set date for any of these projects to start. Gardner says she hopes the CID can help pay for it when the money is there. The commission is asking MoDOT add this and five other projects on its unfunded needs list.